Hello and welcome to my first ever reconstruction. This is going to be a very special one because believe it or not, I broke the Austrian national record in FMC single with a move count of 24 moves. So for those of you who don't know, FMC stands for Fewest Moves Challenge and is a speed cubing category in which you have to find and write down a solution with the shortest amount of moves. There are many techniques which are only used for this category and the funny part is I don't know much about them since this was my first time ever competing in it. So enough said and let's get right into it. Scramble will be on top of the screen. My method was to build blocks or X crosses and try it in many different ways in order to potentially force some lucky cases. In this scramble, it just happened so that building the yellow cross and cancelling into pairing up the first pair in this way would give me a very lucky continuation. We'll see what I mean in a second. So now that we have successfully solved our yellow cross and built our first F2L pair, we can see that the next three F2Ls are very nicely set up. Because if we just do these three moves, it would pair up this F2L and set up this F2L into a very nice three move insert. When inserting our next F2L pair into the front right slot, we can see that it takes out this one, ready to be inserted into the back, without breaking up the one we made before. And now you can maybe see where we're going with this. So now all we have to do to make our first two layers is to insert this pair here. And judging by this big block, if we insert this one with a sledgehammer instead of a regular insert, it just solves the whole cube. So let's go through the scramble one more time and count our moves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four. At this point, a thousand things were going through my head. I thought that there was no way I didn't miss scramble the cube and that this was actually 24 moves in my first time ever competing. To put that into perspective, it takes a computer on average 18 moves and 20 moves at max to solve the Rubik's Cube. In the WCA statistics list, I am placed third in the world for the best solve in the first time competing, and that got me to a world rank of 172 overall. This was probably my most insane moment in my speed cubing journey, since I just signed up to try it out and expected to get an average attempt. While this was without a doubt a very lucky solve, it still took me many tries to find the right solution and I was the only one to find it at that competition. In fact, with 24 moves I got first place, with a massive jump as second place got 34 moves. I just think it's funny how I was able to sit there for half an hour in complete disbelief and had to keep all the excitement to myself. The previous national record with 27 moves has stayed unbroken for almost 10 years, and now, with me breaking it with 24 moves, I can only assume that it won't be broken anytime soon. So, with all things now said, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.